back with the women, an under 61 kilo Nogi match. Carlson Gracie holds Julia Scardone taking on current UFC fighter Molly McCann. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Fighting of the Blue Corner, Julia Scardone. Julia Scardone, from out of Carlson Gracie Hull, where she is a part owner alongside her partner, Owen Livesey. We have seen her a couple of times on Polaris in the past. Uh, she's competed twice on Polaris, neither time uh, the match went her way. She was having a very close match with Melissa Hill before getting caught in an armbar and then uh, did not have a great match in our last outing. Uh, but she is back, and I think stylistically, this is going to be one of the more interesting matches for Julia. And now let's welcome her opponent, fighting on the red corner, Molly McCann. Someone who needs no introduction to fight fans around the world. UFC superstar Molly McCann out here making her Polaris debut to prove the doubters wrong. Let's get the action started. Our next bout is in the bantamweight division, scheduled for 10 minutes. Introducing first, fighting on the blue corner. She stands five feet tall, official weight, 61 kilos. Representing Carlson Gracie Hull from the United Kingdom by way of Brazil. Please welcome multiple time Polaris champion, Julia Scardo. And now her opponent in the red corner. She stands five feet four inches tall, official weight, 60.7 kilos. Representing next generation MMA from the United Kingdom, Polaris Contenders Champion, Molly McCann. It's time. This is going to be fun. I know the nerves is going to be different, but still nerves, man. Oh, yeah. You know, for Molly. So this match is sponsored by Zebra. Zebra, the world's leading training facility outfitter. Jew's uh, going in heavy to start with. I mean, that's pretty standard, right? Yeah, that's true. That's true. I'm not sure what I was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> now, it's great to have Molly on the uh, Polaris card. I know she wanted to do so in the past, and this is the first time that she's had a bit of time off, and uh, the UFC have allowed her you know, we're so lucky to get yeah. current UFC fighters so consistently and, you know, people connected to the UFC and, and through our connections with UFC Fight Pass, we're able to get some incredible matchups that you just wouldn't see usually in pure grappling. Yeah, I expect this match to look a bit like this for most of it with it's, the odd big throw or takedown in there. Yeah, I mean, I have seen, uh, I've seen Molly compete in grappling before. She took on Abby O'Toole in Grapple Fest a little while back at the time. Abby was a student of mine, so I did see the match. It was a physical match, to yeah. say the very least. So, uh, you can see the Jews, uh, Jews kind of red in the face already. Yeah. Jew wants this body lock as well. There's not going to be punches and kicks necessarily, but expect the same aggression and physicality yeah. that you'll see in MMA on nice. the mat here Take tonight. Down. Molly pulling guard. Almost looks uh, like uh, she was going to jump for a triangle there. I think, I think there was actually a kick down. Switching for the armbar. Extension here. We've seen oh, yeah. we've seen Junior wow. get caught by this before. It's on. I mean, the position. Uh, Julia's got such short arms. It is difficult to keep these arms in position, and it it looks like she She's might be able to pass it. But beautiful armbar setup from Molly underneath there, and she's trying to strip the grip that Julia's using to try and defend and apply more torque to the arm. And it, doing a good job of changing the angle, actually. She turned it to more of a Kimura position. Oh, it, it looks even more on now, though. Molly trying to spin underneath. She's doing a great job yeah, of not she's tapping. She's changing, right? She's changed it. More yeah. pressure. Oh, oh, it's it's the the Molly McCann wow. with oh, wow. the armbar submission. Wow. The first submission wow. of our main card here tonight. It hurt, it hurt her. Yeah. I mean, Julia held off that tap for as long as she physically could. 
and this is going to mean everything what to a, Molly McCann. What a statement for Molly, right? Yeah. Massive, you know? massive statement. There's going to be a huge weight lifted off of her chest. She came here to prove a point, and she proved that point. She can grapple. Yeah. yeah. That she, was a beautiful armbar. Great setup. Beautiful. Really nice finish. Hopefully, we're going to see that again in these replays. It's a nice takedown so, by Julia. Yeah, it was a takedown entrance. Yeah, and then she couldn't do anything, she just jumped guard and they started putting the arm already in danger yeah. since then. And then Julia oh, was getting changed in that angle, doing a pretty good job. Ah, she put under the arm, protects yeah, over. Molly tucks it and applies it. Very good. And Julia is forced to tap. Wow. Impressive. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner by tap out due to an arm bar submission, Molly! Mick